Hello, my name is Justice and you're watching the Layman Library YouTube channel. Today we're going to be talking about a GIMP tutorial and for this tutorial we're going to be looking at the Ellipse Select tool. The hotkey for that tool is E. If you press E it will select this tool over here and also next to your cursor you'll see a small circle. We'll press tab to hide our GUI. So in order to use the ellipse select tool you press and hold down left click and these four little squares will appear and while you're holding down left click you'll be able to draw an ellipse from your uh, the point where you started ho holding left click to wherever your cursor is. If you let go it will draw a ellipse or an oval. Now let's say you wanted to get a circle you can kind of sort of uh, draw a circle like this or if you hold down shift um, when you left click it, if you hold down shift it'll automatically draw it in a circle and that'll work in all four quadrants so if you forget and you don't want to do the top side you can just drag it up here it'll draw a circle this works with all of the selection tools, uh, the selection editing tools that we covered in the first tutorial. If you haven't seen it, it'll be in the uh, top right hand corner of the video. There will be a iCard or uh, you can find the playlist that this and the other tutorials are in. But all of the, um, all of the selection tools that are in the other tutorials exist here also. If you need a refresher on those, there is another course, another section that'll show you how to do these. But the ellipse select tool allows you to do these sort of edits. Alrighty, if you have more questions about GIMP, feel free to comment and we'll see if we can make a tutorial on it. If not, check out the uh, playlist and also don't forget to subscribe.